Welcome to my channel, my name is London, and today I have a clothing haul. Oh, I splurged at Altered State. I'm pretty sure that's how you say it, Altered State. But I didn't know that they had a store relatively close to me, and we went Christmas shopping, and we happened to stumble upon this store. And I followed them on Instagram, but I've never actually bought anything from them, and when I walked in, I was obsessed and I was like, this store needs to be my closet. I'm in love. And they also had a sale going on. So I have been holding off on using these clothes because they are technically a Christmas present for me. But if you guys have similar taste in fashion as me, then you might like these clothes because I think they are so stinking cute. So let's start off with some of the like more random things this hat I don't know what it is I just love hats like this and this one is so stinking soft and of course I had to get the matching gloves <laughs> the gloves are so cute oh my gosh they had a buy one get one free I think is what it was for the gloves so I also picked up an orange pair of gloves especially since we're having a cold front right now it's like 75 outside but this weekend we're supposed to have a cold front where it's going to be like mid 20s in the morning so these gloves will be coming in handy because in Texas December isn't really winter yet like it is in some other states but I am prepared if we have a apocalypse again in texas this is another thing that it's just kind of like random but i touched it in the store and it was so soft i just couldn't resist this and of course like this orange color is one of my favorite colors on the planet as you guys are probably going to notice but this one was initially 35 dollars and i got it on sale for 13 dollars so i thought that was pretty cool and again gearing up for winter and then some stuff that I don't have up here with me that I do want to shout out that was also included in this haul was I got two little dinosaur ornaments I thought they were adorable I believe the ornaments were buy one get one as well but they were so stinking cute so I wanted to show you guys that they also had a buy one get one for the socks and Oh my, if you guys are looking for some fuzzy socks, these socks are so incredibly soft. I got two of them. I got one that looks like a gingerbread house and then one with like chocolate chip cookies on them. But they literally feel like lotion is embedded in them. They are so, so soft. And now we're going to get into more of the try on part of it. So these are some pretty thick sweaters i'm not entirely sure they feel a little bit like cashmere but they're a little bit more cropped they're not super long this one is more of a cream color and they also had one in a red ish kind of color that i did not pick up because i already have a kind of cashmere red sweater and then this one is like a really interesting kind of brownie mauve color this i just don't have anything like this in my wardrobe of this color so it was also a buy one get one so I decided to get that one. Now we're gonna get into the jeans and I do want to say that I have completely grown out of all of my jeans in my wardrobe for the last two years. I've been slowly growing out of all of my pants so it's so good to get some new pants and they are right up my alley. This one is my current favorite with these stripes. Oh my gosh. I don't know why the these pants, they're flared out and they're a bit more high-waisted. They give me that 70s show Donna vibe. Anybody else feel that way? Is it just me? I don't know, but... <laughs> I saw these and I was like, these are weird, but I am so obsessed with these. Oh my gosh, these are like my new 
favorite pants and I have a lot of kind of orangey clothes so I thought these would go good with a lot of fall and winter clothes that I have. I wish I had more of this like off yellow shade. I say shade like I'm doing makeup but I'm not a fashionista. I'm not really good at it but <laughs> I need to get more colors like this. Next up I needed cow print. Cow print has been in for a while, but like <laughs> I haven't found anything that I'm super obsessed with until I saw these flared out cow print pants and I w just lost my mind over these. I just had to get them. They are so cute and they fit so well on me. It's been so long since I've had like jean material that really fits good on me. I went up like two and a half sizes in pants, but like I the flare, everything about these pants is just perfect and amazing and I love them. I can't wear I can't wait to wear them everywhere. I got like two of everything. I just realized that. I don't really know why I did that, but now we're getting into skirts and I have two different skirts. Two different flared out pants, two different, two different skirts. Everything's by the twos, but this is like a plaid skirt. I don't know what it is about it that got me really drawn to it. It has more of the like 70s vibe to it, but it's also really like thick material. So I feel like you could wear it more in the fall, winter, spring kind of months and the color is more neutral. So I feel like it's a little bit more versatile that you can wear it in a bunch of different seasons. And then the inside has a little bit of that like liner to it. I have another skirt that I just went bonkers about, kind of like the cow print. And it's this one. It's so cute. Oh my God. I don't really know how to describe the material, material of this. Is it like suede? I don't know. It kind of has like a, suede kind of material i think that's what i'm trying to say but the fringe man the flare and the fringe i can't get enough of the flare in the fringe okay these are the last two things that i have for my haul here but this one i actually wasn't gonna get at first but my boyfriend fiance is obsessed with portal Corduroy, 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 I can't say it, but this is like a, whatever that word is, uh, pink, kind of like a dusty pink jacket, which is adorable. And then the bottom of it in the front, is kind of like torn and uneven. So it has kind of that like vintage look to it. And yeah, no, anything 70s, Western-ish, just, Sign me up. Last, but certainly not least, I saw this and literally jumped over the moon because this is just perfect. I always remember my dad wearing like leather jackets, but this one is that like same orange color that I am obsessed with, and but it's like this faux leather jacket and the inside is super super soft and it's lightweight enough that I feel like you could wear it in a bunch of different seasons but it's also on the heavier side so it can still keep you warm and it's soft on the inside. I just love it. It's a perfect length. It fits so nicely but that is everything for my altered state haul and I can finally throw away the bags because I've been storing these and waiting to film them for after Christmas for you guys. I didn't want to wear them just in case I like forgot. If I leave stuff in a pile, then I'll remember to film it. But if I start wearing it for some reason, I'll forget to film it or I'll just like be like, never mind, I won't film it. But yes, these clothes are stinking cute. I'm obsessed with everything. Definitely check this place out if you haven't. I don't know where I've been living under a rock. I've never, I haven't bought clothes in so long because for a very long time, I went to cosmetology school and I had to wear a uniform. And then I worked at Sephora where you have to wear a uniform for three, 
I worked there for three years. So for having to wear a uniform for five years, it really blocked my fashion sense. And so I never really bought anything that was really fashionable, but getting into like Instagram a little bit more, I've been following a lot more accounts that I've just been really inspired by and I'm obsessed. Let me know what your favorite thing was. Let me know if you've heard of this place before. Let me know what your style is because I feel like you guys kind of know what my style is and I'll see you guys in the next video.